I think that is amazing. The most stupid criminal ever and a technology win. And talking of technology, I tell you what, I cannot stop doing at the moment. Have you got Black Ops yet, Kev? No, I haven't got the new one. God. My God, I cannot do... Do you ever play computer games, Hayley? No. I tell you what, I have I did actually recently. I played um, Grand Theft Auto. Oh, you know the new one's coming out. Not well, spring. Spring big. Cannot wait for that. Big. Absolutely cannot wait for that. Anyway, Call of Duty. I've been playing loads online, and hello to all the people that have added my Xbox tag, Alex Space Baker eighty three. That is my Xbox tag. If you want to come find me on Call of Duty and kill me, lots. I've been playing it so much, so much so that I've got the ballistic knives, which are the coolest thing ever. It's like you can shoot knives at people. Better than knives. a nunchuck. Uh, no, a nunchuck would be the best thing ever. Okay. Why have they not got nunchucks in Call of Duty? That would be amazing. <laughs> but I've just been playing it so much. And I've talked about this on the show before. Have you ever played a game with a headset, Kev? Um, I only, I've only sort of tried it. I've never sort of had a proper session of my own. Mate, you know. you've got to borrow my headset. I can't tell you how mad the difference is. I played, okay. Call, of, I played Call of Duty and Modern Warfare and all these kind of games for years and years and years and never used a headset. Because I've always thought of a headset as being one of those things where it gives you kind of... Uh, just that you can just hear people talking and you know that's it you've got like one ear with a microphone no not the one that comes free with Xbox yeah yeah just really crap like kind of foam I haven't got that I was lucky enough when Call of Duty came out to uh, I got invited to um, this place in London where they had all these headsets these Turtle Beach headsets there's loads of them and they actually gave me one and I was like what isn't that worth like 300 quid and they're like yeah you have it and I was like Amazed, totes amazed. I've been using it so much, and my game has improved so much because you can hear people's footsteps. Oh, that's crazy! You know when you've played these games before, and you come around the corner, and someone's there ready to shoot you. Yeah, and you're like, "How did they know? How did they know? Where, how did they know I was going to do that?" It's because you can hear their footsteps. You can hear them. Oh. Like if you, if you, me and you are playing now, and you ran around my character in the game, your footsteps would be running around my head. It's like it's because it's all in surround sound and stuff. Oh. absolutely insane it's insane I've been thinking loads about technology and another thing that's mad about it is that when, when I got it it's like a wired one it's not wireless yeah. and I was like mm, not wireless Like, surely it would be wireless surely that would be better and the guy was like no because if you're like a serious gamer there's a lag with wireless yep. with cable there's not because it's optical it's like one of those optical cables like with the, you know when the light comes down the, yeah, yeah, yeah. the cable if you've got your head, headset on and you're playing with your TV volume up and you've got one ear out so you can hear the TV and hear the headset. There is a, you, there is a delay even in that circumstance. Oh. So you can hear it in your headset before you see it on TV. It's just, it's just mad. Absolutely mad. And I encourage everyone that's listening now to get a headset and come find me on Call of Duty. And I will probably die lots because I'm not very good at it. Kev, you've got to get a headset and we've got to chat and talk. And also because I want a, I want a party. You know, you do these Xbox parties. Yeah. I want to be able to chat to people because I often think when you're playing people online that they're all, they're all wearing headsets, right? And they're all chatting to each other going, oh, flank up the left side or whatever. Yeah, yeah. But I never do that. It I'm always like a, I'm a lone soldier. Yeah. Anyway, just thought I'd mention that. <laughs> Technology oh, is wow. amazing. And, th- and that's the thing uh, with FPS games like First Person Shoes. Pff, FPS, yeah, FPS, no piggy. Well, dropping the acronyms left, right, center. <laughs> they, um, you, to be good at them, you really do need to work as a team. LMFAO. And you need to communi- <laughs> communicate with your teammates. Yeah, I, well, apparently so. I mean, that's what people seem to be doing and I'm getting battered every single time, which is uh, which is annoying. But that's a technological win in my in my mind and I, it's just something, I, I like getting impressed by stuff. It's yep. not often that I get impressed. In this <laughs> instance, I was pleased by what I had. So, big shout out to all the people People at Turtle Beach, thank you very much for hooking me up with one of your most excellent headsets. You have literally changed my mind and changed my opinion on headsets. Like I say before, I just thought they were just a gimmick, but they actually genuinely improve your gaming experience. I never realised how good game sound was. You know what I mean? Usually you're listening to stuff, right, on your TV speakers. And if you've got like a flat screen TV, this sound's never that good. But when you put the headset on and it's like proper... Oh, man, it's intense. Absolutely intense. But yeah, come and find me on Xbox, Alex, uh, space, Baker, 83. And I'll...